Welcome back, I'm Joe with Hilltop Camper here in Fridley, Minnesota. Today we're gonna to do a quick walk around of a 2023 Jayco Greyhawk 29MV. Follow me and I'll point out some key features. Well first, with any Jayco Class C motorhome, you have the full one-piece fiberglass seamless front cap. Uh, some of the big differences between a Greyhawk and a Red Hawk is you have a fiberglass roof, and now in the 2023 model, you have the automotive grade front windshield in the cap as well. Um, some more upgrades on Greyhawk, the fiberglass uh, steps there, and this fiberglass molding that covers your seam that goes up and down here. Um, also chromed out mirrors with your side view cameras that are built in instead of having them on the body itself. Um, also, all your baggage doors are slam latches on the Greyhawk instead of the turnstile. And uh, yeah, let's take a peek inside. A couple other things I forgot to mention outside is the Greyhawk does come standard with the J Plus, the J Ride Plus package, which is the FSD Coney shocks, um, computer balance drive shaft, and oversized sway bars. And also comes with the four point hydraulic leveling system. Um, taking a look inside, you can see how that front windshield really brings in the light and opens this area up. Um, the 2023 chassis, not a whole lot's changed from last year. Um, you have the 8.95, or they call the 9-inch Sony screen. Um, they have changed the articulating arm on the TV up here, so it will extend further out. And the trim level compared to a Red Hawk is a little higher end. As you can see, like every Jayco, you got a seat belt in every seat, um, a cabinet tree, Full lumber core cabinets. This uh, particular unit is in the modern farmhouse white color. And also like uh, Jayco's patented table here, instead of dealing with pedestals, it just slides on down and then latches back up to the wall with ease. Uh, cushions are in the way or else I'd demo the whole thing for you. But. And also this year that's new with Jayco is your seatbelt anchors for car seats. That's been something that's, I believe, long overdue in the motorhome industry. Um, Moving over to the kitchen, you got a residential feel kitchen here. Uh, pretty big microwave for a motorhome. Galley style kitchen counter. And these are all one piece. It's, it doesn't have the old T molding that shrinks. Um, and then you got a stainless steel double sink. This particular model is equipped with the eight cubic foot gas electric fridge. There is a, a bigger fridge option and you lose the storage though if you run with that. All right, and coming into the bedroom here, you can see the same quality lumber core cabinetry up above the bed. Plenty of storage. Um, this has the new uh, pretty ship lap there behind for the headboard. And if you look over to your left, you'll see a TV for the bedroom that does pull up. Um, it's, it's assisted by struts, and there is a little bit of storage behind there as well. All Jayco's uh, cabinets are lumber core cabinetry, and all the drawers are 75 pound ball bearing sliders. So very homey feel. For a motor comb. Looking at the bathroom here, you do have the, the toilet and sink across the hall from the shower. This door does swing open and lock at the top to give you privacy. A lot of folks uh, miss that part and it looks like the shower is just pretty much in the living room. Kind of like a class A. Um, and you're looking over at the shower here, this is a residential style surround. You do have a glass sliding door and um, Jayco's new fixtures here are all nice and a, a kind of a flat black looking color. Uh, this unit also comes with a 1,000 watt inverter and a power control management system. And as every Jayco, we have a full two-year bumper-to-bumper warranty with three years of structural. Um, so thanks for taking on this little tour with me again. Um, if you have any questions, please reach me at Hilltop Camper in Fridley, Minnesota. And again, my name is Joe. Have a good day.